If he has to back before six minutes. <clears throat> nah, he's just wrong. You don't take ignite on uh, dares. Or, uh... There we go. You take teleport, and then after six minutes, you get a charge of this, and you can swap. So, in the games that you get screwed... Like, if he gets ganked twice or some shit, like, my jungler comes top or some shit, chunks him to, like, half, what does he do? Does he stay there with no HP because he has tele- because he doesn't have teleport? Like, he just puts you in bad spots. So you just take teleport and you never end up in that in that situation. Ooh. Ooh. And then if you have- so if you have the back before six minutes, you can just TP back to lane. And then you swap at six minutes anyways to ignite. Yeah, it kind of times out with when you're getting like level six and shit anyways. Weird. Bloop. I mean, it kind of hurts me a little bit because I can't like all in him level one with like W and shit. I go ham. Because he can ignite and maybe turn it. Oh. Let's see. Let's see here. Take it. Guy's thick though. Tastes like no fucking damage. Pay my ass. Yeah, idiot. Good thing you queued me. You missed the cannon minion. Goofball. Yo, Swapilla, thanks for the sub, bud. Welcome to the Crocodile Crew. Appreciate it, man. Oregano. Thanks for the sub, bud. Welcome. Appreciate that, pal. Yo, Ninja Hustler with the tier 3 for 7 months. Appreciate that shit, man. Welcome back, dude. Dude, the jungle is popping off. Mine's like perma farming. And it's a little freezier though. Just take that. Yo, Wilmo82, thanks for the sub, bud. Oh, welcome. To the crocodile crew. Ooh, don't hit that. 
Guy's flashing away with fucking full HP against a level three dude. As a level five dude. Blow my fucking mind, man. Heal up off of the fucking things enough. And he leveled up, dude. I am the most unlucky fucking human ever. Oh my god. Give me a break, dude. Jesus. <sighs> we have a free fucking kill and this guy flashes away because he's afraid of this fucking dude. He's Identify, my man. Identify. He's a level three. He ain't gonna do shit. Just kill everybody, please. Made that shit so fucking hard. You flash away with like full HP, dog. All right. I get why you were perma farming. Back to the jungle with you. Oh my god. Oh, I am. Yo, Duff, man. What's up, bud? Five months. Welcome back, homie. Appreciate that. Appreciate that a lot. Yeah, my lane goofball. Get out of my lane, goofball. Just stupid ass ignite. Didn't even swap it. Swap the teleport! What do you mean? Did he already TP or some shit? I forgot. Did he already TP? What did he swap to? So confused. Oh, I think I got it with a bleed, dude. <laughs> what? So getting stacks on Darius is important. Getting stacks on Darius is literally everything, my man. It's the entire point. Like you get so much additional uh, attack damage when you have full stacks, and then your ult obviously does true damage. Or not does true damage, but it does like max true damage. Dealing 100 plus 17. That's what it deals as the base, but it gets increased by 20% for each stack that you have. So instead of doing 117, it does 325 true damage. So stacks are super important. And then again, once we get five stacks, we get increased 60 AD. That's massive. That's why in that like first trade, it looked like I was doing no damage to him. Then I got five stacks on and my next like auto W chunked him to like half HP. Cause that next auto W had 60 extra AD on it. Which is massive in the early game cause you got 117 AD total. So I'm getting 60. 
That's over a 50% increase. Wait a second, let me get my let me get my dark harvest tag. My fault. Oh no. Oh no. Can't you don't do it to me. They took barrier instead of exhaust. Oof. Dumbo play. Should have left more minions though. Uh, how can you walk up like this if you have no idea? He has to have people around, yeah. There's no way you can walk up like this. They just kill you. Oh. Brother, this guy's heals so much. I should have just fucking killed him. I thought he was gonna die to the fucking bleeds, dude. Oh, I could have just killed him. I thought he was gonna die to the next tick of fucking bleed. I have five stacks up on the dude. God damn, he heals so much. Ah, fuck. If I just autoed him, he would have fucking died, dude. I could triumph and kill the other guy. Fuck, man. Free double right there. Should have been a free double kill. Damn, I really thought the bleeds were gonna tick down and kill him. Both times. Like, he autoed once, and like the bleed put him at like 1 HP, and I was like, alright, well, he'll definitely die from the next one then. And then he barely survived again. And I auto W the other guy. When I could have just like autoed him one more time, he would have died for sure. Second shield or some shit, dude. He lived forever. Dude, Heimer's getting every tower. Good work, dude. Good work, dude. I'm gonna go back top and get a giant wave. Be great. Sweet. Yo, Tannis, thanks for the 12 months, bud. Welcome back for the year, my man. Appreciate it. Damn, the big one year with the buff proc. Do do. Run it down. Me somewhere, I think. I died really fast, so I be careful.
Trying to get this wave shot. man chains let me auto please what the hell my goofball chance I can I swing I think I had an opportunity to ult Warwick a little earlier and if I did that I could have got reset really can I please get that cannon minion hello give me your life cannon minion what are you doing oh hello there Okay. 